Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to answer the question, can the Fender Mustang GTX play an acoustic guitar? Now we know it can obviously play an acoustic guitar. The question really is, can it play an acoustic guitar? What's it sound like? That's what we really want to know. A lot of you are wondering, why does it matter what if we can play an acoustic guitar through it? Um, to me, it does matter because I needed to only have one amp on the stage. We don't have a lot of space and I needed one that could do both. Why do I need both? Well, I like playing acoustic guitar. That's my number one instrument. But because of the style and type of music that we play, um, it, it pushes me to have to play electric for a lot of the more worshipy type songs because I just simply can't follow um, our piano player. She plays so amazing and great. I just can't keep up with her. That's just honest truth. Um, so I just noodle in my electric and pretend to know what I'm doing. <laughs> that way I can kind of sneak by. Um, but there is times we do play out of the church hymnal. So that allows me some time to play my acoustic guitar. So before I got this amp, um, I was looking on YouTube to see if there was anybody playing the acoustic guitar through it. And I couldn't find anybody. couldn't find anybody. Uh, fast forward, I get the amp for Christmas. Um, fast forward again a week later. I'm back on YouTube, not even searching for it this time. I come across a thumbnail of a guy holding an acoustic guitar in front of a GTX. Now that I've found his page, he's got a bunch of videos about him playing acoustic guitar through this amp. He also makes his own presets. Um, that channel is called Steve Guitar. You can find it on YouTube here. He was playing his acoustic guitar through the amp and it sounded amazing. So I went and found his presets and that's what we're going to be using in the video today. So I've narrowed it down to two of his presets that I like for acoustic guitar specifically. Acoustic Hall and Acoustic Coffee. Those two are great. Um, I've used them both. They both have their own place. They sit in the mix beautifully. They sit in the mix differently. Um, they do sound very similar. They have the same features, um, just different selection on the pedals, of course. Um, I believe it's the same amp choice. Um, so it does sound very similar, but they do have different applications. And uh, I'll talk about that later. Let's not waste any more time and let's get right to it. This is Acoustic Hall by Steve Guitar. Let's check out Acoustic Coffee and see if we can tell the difference.
So as you've heard, the acoustic hall and the acoustic coffee presets are very similar. And as you see on the screen, as they were rolling, they both have a chorus, they both have a compressor, they both have an acoustic they both have a reverb. Um, just different selections for those, obviously. Um, I think the, the, the compressor was the same. Um, but it's the same build, basically, just a little bit different sound for different applications. And they do sit very differently when you're playing with a group of people. Um, they sit differently in the room. To me, the acoustic hall is a bit brighter, um, whereas the acoustic coffee is more spacey and kind of more low on the lower end. Um, and it kind of fills, fills the space differently. So those are kind of used more for a little bit slower songs where you're kind of wanting more emotion. Uh, to me, that's where I use it. Um, the acoustic hall is a bit more bright, and it can be good for fast songs. Um, it don't hang out too much after, you know, when you're strumming, changing your chords fast, you don't want them hanging around too long. Uh, you want them to change with you. So uh, it's good for that application. So there you have it. The Fender Mustang GTX, whether it's the 100 or the 50, can in fact play an acoustic guitar, and it sounds amazing. Just want you guys to know, coming up this weekend, is our first youth day of the new year. Um, so for this weekend, I'm gonna be doing a vlog of the setup. I uh, got some buddies from North Carolina coming in. I'm gonna try to get some clips of that. I'll have clips through, all throughout the day, Saturday, maybe some clips from Sunday. Uh, that way I can try to put together a good vlog for you guys to watch. So be on the lookout for that upload. You're not gonna to wanna to miss it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and feel free to leave a comment. Thank you guys so much for watching. Mm -hmm.